Hello, biology kids. This is Shelby. Um, I'm here. I'm going to do a little experiment. I'm going to teach you some stuff about uh, geothermal energy. Okay. We're going to do this by uh, kind of simulating the Earth and kind of seeing how a or geothermal uh, energy plant would collect the heat from the Earth to produce some energy. So, uh, welcome to my kitchen. It's a little messy. Uh, but we've got this uh, this pot here, okay? We got water in that pot, and there's foil over it. Okay, so the uh, there's a little hole on top. I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh, so basically, the pot represents the earth, and the foil over it represents the crust. Okay, uh, so what we're gonna do is let uh, the earth kind of build up some some heat, so we can utilize it. Okay. Uh, so, I'm going to let some time pass. You guys can talk amongst yourselves. Uh, not for too much longer because I'll just chop this video and start it up so you guys don't even have to experience the weight that I had to. So, uh, so uh, talk it up for a couple seconds. Uh, okay, so uh, things are starting to get crazy. <laughs> okay, not expected. My cat up there, we're just going to ignore him. Whoops. Okay, the crazy part's happening right here. You may or may not be able to see that steam coming out, but it's pretty crazy. Uh, so, um, I'm going to uh, get ready by uh, using my timer here. Um, you can see. Uh, we're going to place our, uh, our energy plant, which is a can with some holes in it. Uh, and we're going to place it over uh, this little tiny hole I made. And we're going to let it sit for like 30 seconds. Okay, so right now it's building energy. We don't want this thing getting too crazy. Alright. It's like lava. Well, not yet. Okay, so uh, we're letting it build up. Should be pretty crazy awesome here in a second. Um, and my cat's still on the fridge. Toby, you're being rude. Okay, so, uh, in theory, should be able to uh, see this thing going crazy. So this steam is actually moving this pinwheel like crazy. So this is really good example of how uh, we can use geothermal energy to create some power here. Okay, so think of that pinwheel as a generator and that generator can produce some electricity for us which is uh, keeping my lights on and stuff. So uh, yeah, there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed my little experiment. It's first time for me and I uh, think it was a success. So. Uh, you guys have a wonderful day. Uh, good luck on your projects too, and I'll see you. I'll see you well right now. Probably seeing you right now. So uh, yeah, bye.